In this video, I'll be showing you how to use the bus stop method of division. The bus stop method is a common way of solving division problems involving two or more digits. In these examples, I will be using a number line. However, you can just use your times table knowledge if you find it easier. Our first calculation is 96 divided by 4. First, we write 96 inside the bus stop and 4 outside. Now, how many 4s are there in 9? Let's count up. 1, 2, 3, 4. One group of 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. Two groups of 4. Can we fit another group of 4 in before we get to 9? No. So, we have two full groups of 4. And how many did we have left over? 1. So, we carry this over into our 1's column. Next, we need to work out how many 4's go into 16. So let's count up again. 1, 2, 3, 4. One group. 1, 2, 3, 4. Two groups. 1, 2, 3, 4. Three groups. 1, 2, 3, 4. Four groups. So 4 goes into 16 four times exactly. Therefore, our answer is 96 divided by 4 equals 24. Now let's try 43 divided by 3. 43 goes inside the bus stop. 3 goes outside. How many times will 3 go into 4? 1, 2, 3. One group, with 1 left over. So let's carry over this 1. And how many times will 3 go into 13? 1, 2, 3. One group. 1, 2, 3. Two groups. 1, 2, 3. Three groups, one, two, three, four groups, with one left over. This time, we have nowhere to carry over that one, so we just add R1, or remainder 1, which means that 43 divided by 3 is 14, with one remainder. Now, let's look at a slightly bigger number. 409 divided by 2. How many twos go into four? One, two, it's one group. One, two, two groups. Two lots of two, exactly. Now how many twos go into zero? None. Finally, how many twos go into nine? One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Four groups with one remainder. So 409 divided by 2 equals 204 remainder 1.